man, you come straight out of a cone. No, they did. Oh, hey, they Dion, did. can you flip your camera real quick? I'm about to switch over to, I told you, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get my computer ready. This is my phone. I can, I can. Oh, no, 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 I didn't hear you. I didn't hear you say that. My bad, so never mind. I didn't well, say that. Yeah, I, I texted um, to you. Yeah, but nah, man, oh, this yeah. is, I couldn't wait to talk about this. Yeah, that's how we were. We were on set when they was releasing everything. Like, we, we were sitting there with Dion stuff, and I saw it, they was like, Wakanda forever. That's like, yo, I'm in here crying. I was like, who crying? Yeah, what that's happened? That's and I was like, that's 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 bro, that's sad. sad. Yeah, man. Like we, because I think then like went. Yeah. But go ahead, my bad, y'all. No, I was just gonna say we was we was editing um uh, like DreamCon footage. You know, what I'm saying trying to get all mm. that together and everything. And that yeah, as they released it, my brother, yeah, um, he was in uh another one with uh where they was actually covering um san diego comic-con so he put it in the group chat i'm seeing that while i'm editing i'm like bro i can't focus on anything i'm doing right now because marvel mm -hmm. is out here killing shit <laughs> boy they can't put right dick on the same with comic -Con. They, yeah, they yeah. Not let's, let's, let's 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 talk about it man let's talk about it oh yeah no no we exactly. recording so uh, hey, ladies and oh it's happening yeah because we do like behind the scenes oh we stuff, already yeah. he said it's happening <laughs> yeah, yeah no, they, <laughs> they, they like this behind the scenes shit yeah yeah Okay. Yeah, I'm about to switch, I'm about to switch up. You might see two versions of me. As soon as it comes on, I'm gonna I'm get out of here. <laughs> yeah, and then when you switch, we'll get started. Two yeah. two variants of you. <laughs> two variants. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, wait, wait. Why are y'all two different two, backgrounds? Uh, How is this possible? Right? <laughs> Why this one got a full beard? Hold on. <laughs> That's hilarious. Hey, I ain't coming in hot, am I? I didn't touch nah, my mic. No, no, no. Nah, nah, you might. Yeah, no. Nah, it's better now. Yeah. Cool. 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 Okay. Yeah, I'm good. Will. I hate that. Yeah, yeah, you good. I hate that I turn my mic off. I mean, I turn my computer completely off, which I haven't been turned off in like uh, <laughs> at least a month. It's and I try to set that muggle. He's like, "Hey, nigga, I'm updating. You gonna have to wait." <laughs> you gotta turn me off. You I'm updating. Hey, nigga, oh, yeah. I'm updating. You gotta wait. <laughs> but yo, so you, you ain't gonna just shove your dick in me. You had to give me some foreplay. <laughs> Oh, wow. oh my God! <laughs> you know, like, my hard drive. And they, and they, get, and they said I'm dirty. Wet. Jesus, <laughs> you gonna have to wait for this. Yo, man. Oh <laughs> man. But yo, before we get started, I'm gonna do this behind the scenes. So people been people been asking uh about it. my Phase Four uh lineup mm -hmm. and why I picked it like that. Girl, Let me go ahead. And shoot. Look. Yeah, let me okay. go ahead and shit on everybody making me more mad because it makes sense. <laughs> so, Clint, since you wasn't here, I'm going to tell you, we, we rated Phase 4 movies. Get ready to get from, pissed. Get ready to get pissed. From worst to best. So my wait, wait, list, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. So my list was from, from worst to best is Thor, Eternals, Spider-Man, Doctor Strange, Shang-Chi, and Black Widow. <laughs> Black Widow is favorite of, of the face. <laughs> Here, I'm hear not. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. I'm not <laughs> mad because Black Widow is actually a very good movie. It is. I didn't, the problem did, with I Black Widow, it to, it's a great movie. I, but for me, when it depends on how you're ranking it, or I, it sounds like you're ranking it from strictly just like a story cinematic perspective. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Or and even just like what yeah. it, or what the movie is. Mm -hmm. Okay, and, and I'm fine it. with that because that's because, how I ranked it, and that's okay. Because I, I, if I were ranking, I would rank it based on what I like, but also I have to add in the one part is MCU relevance. And yeah. I'm not saying that Black Widow doesn't, but it had probably the least. I mean, yeah, we see uh, her sister going to become a part of the Thunderbolts, yeah, but mm -hmm. what that was what a, that was about it. And then Dion you know, like said it best on the last, yeah. and it was like it came out too late. It and that's really yeah. what threw it down. But yeah. this is why I put we, the list like I that. agree. Because I, 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 fuck, I fuck with Natasha heavily. Like, I tell people mm -hmm. all the time, like, she is one of yes. my favorite Avengers because, like, a lot of my favorite mm -hmm. characters, like, in DC, like, I fucking love, like, Red Hood, you know, or Arkham Knight, yeah. depending on how you right. I always like the nigga with the two pistols that's, you know what I'm saying, bucking at niggas. So it's like... The way I see Natasha, yeah, 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 like she yeah, yeah. bout it, like fam, she be on that battlefield. She and then like I, I started playing the Avengers game. She's Nigga, not, she yeah, she has no power. Crazy, she, she, she crazy. crazy on that video game. She, bro, crazy yeah. with the pistols. Yeah. Like, I, I, she do, she really do. If you got her, 
if you got her, she got the guns and then she got that long that, pause, that the stick long stick with the girl, lick. Like, yeah, 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 bro. Yeah, she cold. Yeah, yeah, dog. Like she, she, and she's the fastest one too. Yes, like yes. she's very agile. She flying with her. I, I like Black Widow. If I had to, if I had to rank Phase Four movies, to me, the best one was probably Doctor Strange. Um, okay, and that Ooh. was just because of what it, how it opened up. The MCU, That's what I had as my top. Really two. like. It really, it really opened up the MCU. Then my second one would probably be Shang Chi, um, and Love it you. didn't do anything MCU wise for me, but Shang Chi was a great, great story. It was a great, great story. cinematic, great story. great story, great. It was like it, it, it should have got more. I, I wish it had more MCU relevance than it did, but yeah. it was a that was a powerful, powerful film. Love then I would it. probably give you. Then I would give you Spider Man. Mm -hmm. Um, and more so for the crossover purposes. Um, mm -hmm. I mean, you put in Tom Holland, uh, 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 uh Garfield and, and Tobey Maguire, Maguire all in the same. Yeah. I mean, you can't, yeah, I, I can't be mad. Mm -hmm. Then I would go Black Widow, then I'd go Thor, and mm -hmm. then I'd go Eternals. Okay, uh, I thought Eternals was the worst one just based off of the fact that the Eternals didn't like, I just like, what's the point? What's the point of this? Here, you know what I'm saying? The, like, I get the the Ordrin and, and Celestials and all that. Mm -hmm. I get that. Mm -hmm. But it was just like, why who why should I care about them? And I have a good I have a good reason why that didn't work and why I put it in the order I did. I put Thor at the bottom because it's too new mm -hmm. and I only saw it once. So I couldn't give it the reins to want to put it up any higher. For yeah, I really like Thor though, y'all. Yeah, I, like I, like really like I like Thor. I like Thor. I like Thor. So here's the thing. I, I really like all of it. So for me, my, my list was almost similar to yours, Clint, except that I did have uh, uh. A uh I did have Thor last and I had Eternal second. But yeah. the, but because okay. like I said, I'm basing it off of like to me, like the way they did Celestials was like I thought that that was like the the perfect way to see a giant. Like if I felt that when yes. I saw it, like yes. damn. But yeah. here's the thing, what you said about yes. Shang-Chi, where it actually does tie in. If you finish all of Miss Marvel, like I love like to yeah. me seeing how the how you know what I'm saying how that dimension dimensions that oh. they're definitely they're focused. There's yeah. a difference between earth, I mean different multiverses and different realms and dimensions. Yeah, that's yeah. A, that's a big thing. And then with Shang-Chi, I forgot that's a whole different. Uh, was it a different yeah. realm or a different dimension that he that that that, that his ancestry is from? Well, yeah. well, also I think that got something to do with Kang. I think Kang got something to do with the Ten Rings. So yeah. that's why I think that's where that signal comes from, and that was one of our first introductions Ooh, okay. to him in there. But that, but for okay. Eternals, but I Eternals yeah. is good. But Eternals yeah. is good as a non Marvel movie. Like if you just said Touchstone Films well, made this and it's all these people and it's not about the it, comic, this would have been great. Dope, yes, but I remember. I, think I what agree. We, I what agree. we said, I feel. I feel like this is. And it have tells the, a good story. Yeah, yeah, I feel like this is going to have the same impact that Age of Ultron had. Like Age of Ultron came out and people was like, "Nigga, what?" Wow. But then, but then yeah, years yeah, later, yeah. people were like, "Oh shit, it makes sense." I feel like it once we sense. get once we get yeah, deep they tied in, in a lot of it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Once we get deep in Phase Six, people are gonna go back on Eternals. Yep. Like, oh, okay, now I see why. Okay, and, well, and here's my spot. Can I ask you a question? Did y'all rank them? No, my bad. I'm sorry. Sometimes it might be lagging on my end too, so y'all might be talking. And I didn't, I didn't see it or anything like that. But my question was, did y'all rank the shows too? No, 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 no. We didn't I was gonna say that. I was gonna say that we should do that at the end or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can but, do that. But I, but I, but I will say, okay. arguably, okay. think about this. Arguably, I think Shang 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 Chi is the best origin story out of all the heroes. Yes, yes. Because Iron yeah. Man is yes, like, no, yes, not, it's, not, it's the like intro. That. I was like, man, this is a great yes. story. And it in it 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 did it, it, it not lag. It gave great character development. It wasn't the same. You know how in the in the Jesus. first movie they always had the same villain? It yeah. was a totally different villain. I was like, this is what I'm talking about. It it gave I love us a, it actually gave right. us a better look into the mythical and mythology side of Marvel on Earth than mm -hmm. anybody. Yes. Like mm -hmm. that was that was the yes. one. Like for you said for Iron Man, Iron Man, we got to focus on him. Shang Chi showed us a whole world, the Woo! Ten Rings, yes. the Asian yes. culture, yeah. the mythology behind yes. it, and it showed how yes. it centers around him and yeah. his sister. Because people keep sleeping yes. and forgetting his sister gonna get her own series yep. for the Ten Rings. 
But this is yeah, why they yeah, sleep yeah. on it because of Spider Man. And this is why, and I know people finna get real pissed at this. People gotta get off that hype a dermic needle of seeing them three <laughs> Spider-Man. Because if you take away the hype of seeing them, that story was ass. No, yeah, I mean, was the villain no, 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 was no. Yeah, the villain was here, still And here, no, was. here's why. Here's why. Let me tell you. Hey, you know what fucked it up for them? Endgame. Because of the fact that Spider-Man said, oh, we got to save all these people. Let's go back to Endgame. All of them knew when uh, yep, Hope went yep. to go talk to the uh, Sorcerer Supreme. Yep. When you change something, that timeline yep. creates a branch. So everything in this movie he did yep. did not matter because they were going to become variants and then get killed anyway. And so the <laughs> fact that we already right. knew that too is just like, yo, this don't make no sense. And then that's the only reason why I couldn't raise Doctor Strange. That he's trying Strange to save too. these guys, yeah, yeah. Yeah, because there were too many yeah. obvious things. Like even in Doctor Strange, I love the movie, but I wish they would have gave us together. The last, I wish they gave us the last thirty minutes with Charlize Theron's character because I couldn't get over the fact that if two things, if if Scarlet Witch is this powerful, one, why couldn't she just rewrite her kids into this reality? Just saying. Number two, yeah. if she's going to yeah. a different universe. Why could you not go to one where that version is dying of cancer and you take her place and you got your kids back? We've been pushing that for like five episodes. I was like, yo, I could not get past that. No, that's, that's, like, yo, no, no Will, I, that makes so much sense. It does make and sense. Then, then here's the last part. To, and there's a part to that too I want to add like that I didn't like about the multiverse or, or what he did was, you know, you need to like, he needed to spend more time in Earth 838. I felt like Earth 838 was just like a quick, oh, we're here, and that's it. No, nigga, you fell, and you're dressed completely different than mm. everybody else. Yeah, I yeah. wanted to see more of what, like, I'm not saying Marvel cameos or anything like that, but who are the Avengers in 838? Mm. Who is the, like, who, like, what, how is there in humans in 838? Do you, like, that, that to me, you, they missed, the, they just missed the mark with that because now, mm. I think they could have just set up a bigger because there's going to be an incursion. We know this. Oh yeah, being on what's what's yeah. happening. Oh, and I got my theory. There's going to be an incursion. incursion take place. Yeah. But I, I know I, why. But my thing I, is, I, is I, just like I just think they should have stayed more. I would have. I would have hundred percent loved was if I would. I would have hundred percent loved if they piggyback off of Spider Man and said, "This is what you fucked up. We're gonna have to fix this." Yeah. I would have loved that. But I know yeah, why yeah, 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 they yeah, didn't. Yeah, they yeah, didn't. Yeah. They didn't do that. I know why, because they're like, this is still Stony's property. Mm -hmm. and we marvel. Yeah. By any chance, we, we fuck up again. We don't want their story to be tied into our story. Yeah. Nope. So that's why they had like a very yeah. small mention of, of Spider-Man. Yeah. They're like, yeah, I... I because <laughs> yeah, I was like, I see small. what y'all doing. Yeah, yeah. Very, so, and if, so and if you do notice name. too, just, just like you said, Dion, they said it in that movie, but they made it seem like Spider-Man don't exist in this MCU universe, because right. it was like, because he was like, <laughs> Spider Man, Spider Man should be multiversal, yeah. especially how right. they were talking. And the fact that she don't even know a Spider Man exists, yeah, that was yep. very smart of them to not include like, yeah. him yet. Yeah, yeah, it was like, yeah, he's like, Have you, mm -hmm. are you familiar with multiverse? He's like, yeah, we've done something recently with the Spider Guy. The one, like, what? He, spider what? <laughs> <laughs> the one thing she was talking about is what. The one thing that y'all said that I do agree on, though, they this was uh, if back on Doctor Strange, that was the dumbest version of Doctor Strange that we've gotten out of all Doctor Stranges. I feel like he made a lot of mistakes. That is like, bro, like at some point, when are you going to be the Sorcerer Supreme? Like you, like, like you should be thinking like that. But you made like that, like that's what I did. That like what I didn't like about Spider Man. I'm like, bro. You did this child. You didn't ask nothing. Peter said, "Hey, let's do this." You said, "All right, boom." Like you didn't ask no <laughs> questions. Did, oh, you got mad at him because he didn't check about school. You didn't right. check to see if you could throw it back. You didn't check to ask that for you went down in the mythical <laughs> room and start doing shit. Didn't ask, but didn't do. Yeah, any I agree research. with all this. Yeah, <laughs> and then you know what? Too, you remember the last episode we were talking about Marvel needing an anchor. It ain't yeah. gonna be strange. I now yeah. realize it's hey, gonna wow. be Wong. Wong is finna be the anchor to all of this because that's who we get along with a lot better. That's who we like seeing. And the thing is, we I love the in and out about it. Oh, uh, Dion, did you get your uh, computer fix to update? It, it keeps saying, like, yeah, no. I can I can turn it on. It's gonna be this right here. It's gonna be this. Okay, let's, let's if you can't it, just wipe the screen a little bit so it get off that. Glow. Oh, is that bad, huh? Yeah, we'll got a little glow. Got a little glow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He just got a little glow. We're still, like, we're still in the pre-show. 
So make sure you look, you look you look good out here. Look, it, it was oh. Ernest, man. Ernest was coming for you, man. He said, <laughs> that nigga Ernest. Ernest out here wild. Yeah. No, go ahead. Go ahead. Go for, go. I, I was about to say, since we talking about the series, y'all ready to rank these series? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. But, so of course, but if you had, if you still if you still have the thought, go and finish your thought. Oh yeah, yeah. So yeah, while we finish that, so it's like, yo, I think I think in Loki season two, I think we're going to get to see more into what happened in the multiversal war. Um, yes. that he was talking yeah. about. I think that's where, where we're going to see Loki get a lot of his driven from because he has to figure out, okay, how did this start? How did it end? And how do we take care of this now if he keeps saying right. that history is bound to repeat itself? I think right. Quantum Mania is going to give us Kang the Conqueror and we see that yes. version. And then Loki too is what's going to give us the multiple versions Variant. of Kang and the different right. variants of him. Um, and, then but just to, and then to culminate it all with, you know, you know, Kang Dynasty, the Avengers Kang Dynasty. Like this, this nigga, you gotta. We're they're literally gonna have to fight yeah. like twenty versions of this nigga. <laughs> yep, and we're gonna get into that yeah. because that was included in Phase Six. So, we, but we're gonna get into that. But um, I know one thing that you know we did rank the uh, Phase Four Marvel movies, and so I think it's only right. Like Clint brought up in the behind the scenes that y'all can check out. <laughs> that we you know we break down the shows. Who yeah. had the best? So okay. Um, I'm gonna go. I'm go. I'm gonna go worst, worst to best for me. Okay. All right. Worst for me was the Falcon and Winter Soldier. I agree. All right. Then I'm gonna have to hit Wait y'all minute, with uh, all the series. I got you. Yeah. You can write it down. You can write it down. You can write it down if you want to kind of rank you. But it's right crazy because it wasn't bad though. It wasn't a bad series, and, but I can see man, why that's the they, worst one. I. I, I I, I think there the idea of it was a great idea of the people that was blipped was like we should be dominant over the ones that came back. I, I think it was a great idea, but because of the coronavirus original story, it jacked up. They took out a whole bunch of stuff, a whole bunch of reshoots, and it was like this, this story is all over the place. It's it and the thing is they didn't take it far enough. And I think because yeah. it was this, yeah. they didn't take it far enough. Like, yo, this is a this is a pol and also to the terrorists. That's a political show. Email. It's a very political yeah. show because you didn't really 100%. dive into a lot of it, which you could have really jumped into. And I don't think Captain America has yet to really go hit that hard because even so, yeah. like with Captain America and even like uh, the Winter Soldier, we don't get to see politics like that. The politics we mm -hmm. kind of see was within Shield and its factions. This one had to yeah, do yeah. with the world, and it was just right. like. I don't think y'all gonna try right. to depict that in a bad light as y'all should have, because just like how these people who are to like put refugees where they go, that's FEMA. Mm -hmm. And they did a horrible yep. job, just like in this show. But it was like, yo, you didn't press on that. It was just kind yeah. of like, even the fact of Captain America being black or the fact of him really giving up that shield. Like it yeah. was just like, yo, it was still kind of just slid under, just like, yo, why didn't you take it? Why did you well, let right. this guy get? Or even showing the yeah. polls of going like a black Captain America, give me a fanatic. Yeah, that yeah. You didn't give us any yeah. of that. You kind how of tried to yeah. make this How buddy. do people really yeah. feel about having a black Captain America? <laughs> right, yeah. right. So what's your next uh, one? Uh, next, as the worst, <clears throat> I'm going to have to hit you out with um, Miss Marvel. Wasn't a fan of it. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm gonna put that that's right cool. there. Right, that's cool. That's okay. That's uh, cool. Then yeah. I'm gonna go with Hawkeye. That's what I thought was next before. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's what. That's, I then I'm gonna go. I thought that. Then I'm gonna go. Yeah. Then I'm gonna go with Moon Knight. And then I'm gonna end it with uh, Loki, and then Wanda. Wanda is number one. Wanda's number one for me. Ooh. Okay. Oh, hold on. So what if? What I'm if go also a series? Yeah, uh, what if it's, it's so it's honorable, it's, it's honorable a, mention? Can we say honorable? Yeah, mention? yeah, yeah, for sure. It, it's it's like it's like a bunch of movies, so it's yeah. hard to kind of rank it as a series. It's, okay, it's great. Um, okay, so we'll put we'll put it as an honorable mention because it is yeah. almost like it's hard. To um, I I mention. definitely enjoy them all, um, but it's like it's so hard to rank it because like it's, it's a bunch of short films. Mm -hmm. I got um, you. I, I would put it after. Um, after after Loki, number three. Okay. Okay, I can see that. Yeah. 
Uh, Clint, what about you? So you got Falcon, Winter Soldier, WandaVision, Loki, What If, Hawkeye, Miss Marvel, and Moon Knight for the Phase Four series. I'm gonna rank them. I'm gonna rank them from best to worst. For me. Okay. I can't do worst to best. I got to do best to worst. Okay. The best one to me was Loki. Loki, hands down. I think <clears throat> he, that as far as just implications, storytelling, it even came full circle with his character. You know what I'm saying? Like Loki accepted who he is, but also he, people change and he, and he's changed. You know what I'm saying? In a sense. I mean, he's still mischief and blah, blah, but like I, I started real feeling bad for Loki. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And that was hard especially that version of him then, from the first Avengers. Yeah. Yes, exactly. Exactly. Then before you move forward, be before you move forward, be before you move forward, there was about two episodes in Loki that could have been, it, it didn't help the stories at all. It was like they were in that in between, like it was like, uh, well, when I they didn't went know that, that the one when, when they were on Lamentis, yeah, it was kind of like, this is a waste, this is a waste of an episode. I, didn't I know they were trying to get the relationship, a, yeah, I, 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 I know they were trying to build the relationship with them. Yeah, it was the relationship, and I don't think it was a waste just for the simple fact of it helped me learn a little bit more about who Loki really is. More of her. Are. And him, no, and him too. No, and, and him too. But and him, and he, has, he has some very powerful lines in that. That was episode four, if I'm not mistaken, because episode right, right. five was the one where they were, where they, they, were, in, where they were Loki in the was in the... Uh... They went to see the council, and that's yes. when they cut their yes, heads off the and all of that stuff. Yeah. yeah. Right. So yeah. Um I, I love it. I love it when she was a mysterious. I, I'm sorry, before I I, I, I love you. when I love the first three episodes when she was a mystery. I was like, oh, this show is this show is incredible. She was only a mystery yeah. for like two though. I think the first two she was a mystery. Yeah. yeah. And then the three, three were goes. by three, yeah. Keep then going. my second didn't WandaVision. I like WandaVision. Um, not too much like so for me, I had to. WandaVision took me on a journey um, because I had I had to be patient with it because at first I didn't understand. Oh yeah, of course. The entire yeah. the, I didn't understand the whole you know sitcom shtick. I didn't understand what she was doing. Um, don't forget we're fresh off of the blip. I'm expecting right. a bigger. Yeah, I don't know what's happening, yeah. but it, the payoff was great. So mm -hmm. I'm and I'm a fan of that. Like if you're going to if you're going to drag me along, the payoff better be good. For me, yeah, the payoff yeah. with WandaVision was excellent. So yeah. there's that. Um, number three series to me was I liked Miss Marvel. Oh, Marvel. thank you. Miss Marvel was hard, yeah, yeah. bro. Miss Marvel was very me, good, bro. It let was me say well this. done, well executed. It told it, it, it did a good job to me. This is just me, Dion. It did okay, a great you, job of introducing a brand new character. You know what I'm saying? Telling a whole and like even learning about the Nord dimension and blah blah blah. Like that was a very good like. And you know what else I liked about it? It was for teenagers because my you know sure. my my, uh, my my daughter my stepdaughter likes it, and it sure. was great to watch that with her and like be able to like I was just I was a really good fan of what they did making yeah. it lighthearted without with with also moving forward to MCU like it wasn't sure. super dark like when I thought when the DODC was coming in I'm like oh man they about to take her they about to torture this little girl and blah 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 nah that's not what happened like yeah. she was also on a journey to finding herself like I she's and she's also an average 16 year old I yeah. like it it's it's not even about her it's it's about how strict Muslims are she got so much grace episode one you cannot go. She went anyway. I'm sorry, mom. I got caught. Hey, I know this is kind of a bad time, but can I go to? All right, just one time. She do something else. Mess up a whole wedding. I'm sorry, mom. I messed up. Can I go overseas and see my so and so, so and so? All right, you. Are, this has been in your soul, but I'm going. I'm like, why did she get so much grace? You I have been called over, in I havoc. Think I think you're over. I think you're overthinking. I think you're overthinking parents. <laughs> This is well, I know, I know this, I know Muslims. Well, you I know, but, Muslims, but that's a, but that's a, that's a, that's a very stuff. blanket statement to say. That's like and somebody saying, I know black people. And you're right, you're right. Because you, you know, we, <laughs> yeah. we don't, I don't, I, I don't, I wouldn't whoop my yeah. child today. 
whoopings don't the way I was raised is not the way I'm going to raise my child. And I think right, that there's right. a hint of that. It, and there, I and shouldn't have said Muslim. And, 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 <laughs> and it's that balance inside. So you also got to look at like her parents. Like one, her mom yes. is an outcast because her mother is an outcast because yep. they come yep. from a so-called yep. crazy part of the family. Yep. Two, her dad's yep. very optimistic and stuff yeah. like that. So it's like, yo, whenever her mom get mad, it's come on, like, let's just kind of take a little bit off, off of her. Like, yo, she's 16. It's new. You remember how we were when we came to this country? Because again, you got to remember her mom was a rebel. So she went right. outside a lot yep. of those Muslim traditions that you would be saying that might be brought up. But what I like about it was the fact of at, you're mad about not, not even that mad, like, you know, like that point. But the point I loved about it was the fact that they did not keep her identity from them. They allowed her to tell right. her, hey, I'm Miss Marvel. I have these yep. powers because I would have hated to see this one, this 16 year old have to balance trying to hide that because it wouldn't make sense. Your parents right, don't right. know you shooting energy and stuff out of your room. Right. Like I, right. I found that hard to believe. So I'm glad I, I really did. enjoyed Miss Marvel. My, and my, my mom called me shooting. Is behind her. A community is behind. My her number. In fact, my no number more. four is Moon Knight. Um, yeah. here's why I like Moon Knight. I didn't know anything. I'm not. A, I didn't read the comics or anything like that. I knew nothing about who Moon Knight was, what Moon Knight is, what relevance he plays in the MCU. But what I like was just like, I'm a history buff. It played into that very well with Egyptian, you know, mm -hmm. like, and they really, you know, using the duat and stuff like that. Like, that was the end. Man, can we just talk about the acting of of, 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 uh, of Oscar Isaac? Uh, Oscar Isaac. Oscar, woo! Yeah. Like, to yeah, be I able believe to play it. two different versions of yourself, then you're going to play a third one in Jake Lockley. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Like I, I really enjoyed. I really enjoyed seeing seeing him. You know, be 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 three different people. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Man. Like to being, you know, you know, to be we Mark forgot. Spector, to be. Yeah. Yeah, we yeah. forgot. We like, forgot and, and that it's the same person. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and he's talking to himself. Yeah. Like yeah. this is crazy. And to so I love himself. that. Yeah. Number from Apocalypse. Yeah. Yeah. So uh my number five, my number five series um in order, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go Hawkeye was five. Mm -hmm. Um, I like a good holiday, some holiday shit. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? It came out right around the holidays, it played into the whole holiday theme. Like I enjoyed that. I enjoyed seeing a good quality Christmas themed show. And yeah. basically for me, it me, was very believable. I loved it. Yeah. 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 And and for me, it also introduced Kingpin. It introduced, you know what I'm saying, which, you know, mm -hmm. this that's going to introduce a whole different situation. But also, you know, Kate Bishop, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, this is the new Hawkeye. Hawk, Clint, 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 uh, whatever, Clint, whatever last name is. Clint Barton, <laughs> Martin, I think his last Barton. name is. Yeah, it's yeah, your man. name. No, I was trying <laughs> to say Coley too. That's what I was like. No, it's not. Hey, I was about to say the not, same thing. I was like, it's Damn. not Coley. I'm it's like, not it's Coley. not Coley. It's something. It's else. not Coley. You're right. Coley. Exactly. And yeah. then I'm gonna I, say Falcon and the Winter Soldier. It took it to Falcon to me, to me. It just it. Well, if I forgot any, I'm sorry. But like my, my last one is probably a Falcon and the Winter Soldier. Just on the strength of just, I didn't care. Yeah, I like, did I'm not I just care, care, man. That's what it is. Yeah, it was he all nailed. over the place. You nailed it. Care. That was it. You just didn't care. Yeah. See, I did though. See, okay. Well, well, we're gonna not, get yeah, more, I just you? didn't like. I want to hear your ranking. Did I miss any series? No, no, you got to and then what if? What if what we say that's an honorable mention just because it's called What if it's just a set? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, for me, your mine's is kind of like yours too, but uh, I do have a little bias in it. Um, so for one and two, it's one division and Loki, and they switch out. For now, I'm going to put one division as number one only because of, you know, the story it had behind it, but also the real life thing it had for me. So, like a very close friend of mine um passed away from kidney infection uh last year, and that was the last wow, series wow, we wow. watched together. So, like wow. we literally and so like we kept wow. talking about yo, like if Magneto's gonna be here, like yo, we had so many theories about what was gonna happen. And so, like, what was crazy about it was he he literally passed two days after the last episode aired. Wow. <laughs> Yeah, he literally was like, yo, I'll call you right back. So I'll say this. That's right. You gonna change it, Clint, because of that? <laughs> <laughs> like, you know what? No, but I, but it's number, but it's my it's but it's 
it's my number two series, but you know, yeah. so it's not like it can't be number one. I just I loved Loki so much. Yeah. But I like I love one division because and I had to put number one because of how the story was told, the idea of what they did for her. And to be honest, that was the first and only time I've seen them really utilize the 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 capability of what the Scarlet Witch can do. From from what we've seen, it was just the dreams, and then most of the shit was just energy balls. This is the first time I've seen this woman rewrite reality, and it's just from heartbreak. So imagine yeah. her having full right, control right, over right, it, can do right. whatever she wants. So <clears throat> right, I was like, yeah. this is dope. It showed us vision, everybody. But the number two is right. Loki because right. Loki already knew who he was, and I love to see what they did with his variant to lead him to get us back to even the Loki that we had got accustomed to before Thanos killed him was this person that's just like, yo, there's a lot going on with you. And it gave it gave so many layers, and I was like, yo, I think the biggest person they don't really applaud in that series is Owen Wilson. Owen Wilson gave us so many layers Man. to Loki, like the conversations he'd have with him. Right, it's like, I agree. yo, why do you kill? Why do you act like this? Like, skip all the bullshit. Skip trying to go through these. Nigga, Why time, are like, you the person you are? <laughs> yo, and it's just like, yo, for him to really have that and show that breakdown, it's like, yeah. wow, bro. It shows you so much. So that was why it was like, I, I battled with them in number one and number two. Um, and then for Moon Knight and Marvel, it's the same thing. Both great stories for characters that you don't know anything about. But it, and it all really is based off of do you like darker versions of shows or do you like, you know, the more um, lighthearted like you have Miss Marvel? So, again, those two flop for me in the positions of three and four. But Miss Marvel is a perfect example of why Hawkeye has to go under both of them, because Miss Marvel allowed you to get attached to her. I yeah. want to see what's going to happen to Miss Marvel now. Hawkeye didn't do that. I didn't get that same. Yeah, I don't, I'm not Kate attached. Bishop. I'm not attached to the new Kate Bishop. I'm not attached I'm to not. Kate Bishop at all. Out of out of everything that happened <clears throat> in that series, the biggest takeaway for me is that Kingpin is here, and also Kingpin has powers because he was launching yep. people around, and we didn't see that in the other <laughs> series. So and he got shot point blank, and he's not dead. Yeah, and Echo, 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 Echo was stopped more fired than everybody in the damn series. So it was just come like, on, man. But hold on, before you before you move forward. Do you understand how incredible Hawkeye's story is? Hear me out. He told his whew, I'm gonna get chill once again. He told his kids, I will be there in five days, right? Each episode was a day, and it was counting down. So he was like, Hey, I'm so sorry. He's like, I need to get out of here. So every episode I felt like I just want you to get home to your kids so you can be home for Christmas. Things kept happening. He's hiding his story from his family. Are you okay? Yeah, it's getting out of hand now. You sure? I think. Do you have you found a watch? Oh, what's going on with his wife? So I'm like, oh, yeah. I was more concerned. See what I'm saying? So I was like, I was more concerned about Hawkeye versus Kate Bishop. So I was like that. We're not gonna see him no more. Yeah, like he retired. Yeah, he retired. Yeah, he he retired. Like, you bust out. And, he dead. and then too, it's like you went for different reasons that we learned it was like yo so you weren't out there to spend time with your kids yeah you were on a mission and it was for your wife who used to be with shield and you know no, he had his outfit his outfit he was like this is about to get in because i did some dark stuff in his outfit i, I need the to bury his outfit, outfit. No, no 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 right no. remember that's what tied him to kate bishop remember he was in new york already because they went seeing that film and they right. said that it was supposed to be him taking the kids out. But remember, at the end of Hawkeye, they asked you, yo, were you able to get that ring? And it's like, yes, because that ring had a file on it that was needed for them. So he yeah. was already on a mission for her. And so yeah, it's just yeah, like, yeah, he was. what does she do? Mm. And what has oh. she been doing this whole time? But, but again, too, are we going to get that? Because that seems like that's the end of Barton. Like, and yo, I'm, I'm riding off into the sunset. I'm done. Yeah. And nah, then, I don't care what you then, say. I love Black. Like, and, and then also with, with Hawkeye, like, I don't know if it was for y'all, but for me, the whole thing, I'm like, all right, it seemed like it's Kingpin. So my whole thing, investment in the show was, am I going to see fucking Kingpin? Like, yeah. <laughs> like, and, and like I didn't care. And also, too, I didn't like that. Ronan didn't Ron, like they very much downplayed this Ronan character. Mm -hmm. They did. Like most people, yeah. like first up, like first up, how'd you lose your suit? 
He didn't tell us that. Like, where did how, he yeah. how does a, a master assassin get his suit stolen? But I'm like, all right, I let it rock. Mm-hmm. Secondly, how is it no one is coming after you? You've killed hundreds uh-huh. of people. You have killed. You should be people. arrested. Yo, and the only person that is after you is Echo. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. It didn't make it didn't it didn't it's like it, it really downplayed the Ronin character. And I think too, like it goes back to like I said, because of Disney and not lifting them ratings yet, you don't get to show this shit. Cause like, yo, this dude slaughtered. Slaughtered. Yeah. He was in the underbelly going crazy. Crazy. Like, so like it, it should have we should have saw top mob. <laughs> Gangster villains coming at his ass, like nah. Uh, <laughs> Yo, the fact that Ronan's suit even on auction, that should have been one of the reasons of attacking this place. Like her, yeah. like Kate Bishop's thing, because like Hawkeye was making it seem very like, like, yo, like you don't understand like what you've done. It's like, yeah, because y'all not really showing the ramifications of her putting this suit on. It's like, yo, yeah. this dude killed like 83 people that I <laughs> put a bullet in him. Yeah. Like we didn't see none of that. Yeah, like, yeah. We didn't see no all-out assault on trying to yeah, find yeah, this dude. Yeah. Nothing. It was just one person who partially came in here. Endgame. Partially in Endgame. And how you got arrested? I think. Um, I think um, Don Cheeto was like, "Hey, your boy needs to get picked up because he out here wilding. You're right. the only one he that can stop that. him." He did yeah. mm-hmm. And and to be fair, after all this is done, you still should be arrested. I'm sorry. <laughs> like. I know no, you're and then, and then too, hold on, hold on. Weren't you already arrested? <laughs> yeah, Weren't you sitting in a prison with Ant Man and then the cat break y'all out? Yes. But then yes. they did, but then again, too, they said like that. I think too. Oh, yeah, no, no. Because what they said was, I forgot they did say in um, I think in game. No, yeah, in Endgame. Bart and uh they made plea deals, so that's how we got Ant Man yes, 2 with yes, the anklet, right. and mm-hmm. that's how he got to go back. Was they gave yep. they gave them pardons for what they did. Yep. Um but still, there was not a lot of ramification for it. So that's why it's like, I get you're going with the whole Christmas diehard feel. And it definitely gave me all of that. It did. But, yeah. But outside of it, it was like, yo, it didn't get me no more hype for Kate Bishop. I'm definitely, it's like, I don't need a Hawkeye 2 showing her. It's like, yo, give me cameos of her until y'all get Young Avengers. Mm-hmm. And then um, lastly is, of course, Falcon and Winter Soldier, because like I said, I, I, I didn't care. Just didn't there, were ele- there were elements there that they just didn't stick on it too. Like I say all the time, and I'm going to keep saying it, y'all are bullshit for the way y'all introduce Cap Suit. And I, <laughs> all I, I do agree with that. I do agree with that. I like y'all ain't shit for that. With the wings, everything. I'm like, yo, you gave us two minutes of nothing. I said, and that yep. that's foul. Y'all wrong for that, especially to be passing the buck of a person who's going to supposedly be the leader mm-hmm. of this yeah. next phase. It's like, yo, like, y'all could have done better. I don't give a fuck Ooh. about this little duo you got between him and the Winter Soldier. Because now, too, when is he going to be put back in here? He has yeah, no when does he fit in here anymore. Yeah. And again, he still assassinated a lot of people. He should be arrested. We Don't forget that. <laughs> he should actually Dude. be, should be <laughs> killed. They did not pardon him. <laughs> He was definitely not pardoned. Uh, you <laughs> still on the run, like like, and so and that was my thing. It was like that that type of that type of uh like hostility that he had walking around, and it's just like people look at him like, yeah, no, that's not me, and I'm gonna you, keep going. That's what that yeah. Ronan feel should have been with Kate after she put that stuff on. I needed. Yeah. Can that. you blame that? On, can you blame that on mental Ill, illness? Like, hey man, that wasn't me. I was being programmed. Yeah, you still get the rest. You still get fifteen to six. Because you can't. Because the thing is, you can't prove it. You can't prove it anymore. Because the only one that can prove it <laughs> is Zemo, and you and we don't know where he at. <laughs> And that was my thing too. It was like, yo, like y'all, y'all have so many opportunities to really jump into the underbelly of Marvel that y'all don't want to do it. Like the best version yeah. I've seen them jump into the underbelly again was Sean Chi. Because yeah. it was like, yo, why wasn't this like where Agent 13 was? This looked dangerous. This looked like yo, like you ain't like yo, you come here mm-hmm. if you're doing some off the wall stuff. And we haven't gotten that yet. So I think they're still trying to be kind of like this with the underbelly of Marvel and the yeah. magi- the dark magician side of Marvel. So we're gonna see what they do when they get into that. But that was how that was that's how I ranked them. Uh WandaVision, Loki, Miss Marvel, Moon Knight, Hawkeye, and then uh Captain America and the Winter Soldier. 
How about you, Deuce? I think that's a solid, right, so. a solid. So my top one is one division, right? <laughs> my top one. My now, top one. My top, top one. one. <laughs> my top one. Now my top slot goes to one division because I feel like so. I think we talked about. I agree. It either two or three episodes ago, we talked about like right now. This is the first time that we're seeing Marvel play with actual movie themes. Like these movies are not just superhero movies no more. Like you know what they did with uh one um with uh multiverse of madness was a horror what they did with you know like um, it was a horror yeah, yeah so like we're seeing like them playing with themes and i feel like wandavision ushered that in with those first three episodes like we got to see them really play into the tv tropes it's got them you know playing with certain you know long pretty much like the long con like you know with agatha mm -hmm. the reveal of agatha and everything like that yeah but so like yeah. i really appreciated the cinematic value that they gave it's us great. with that and then yeah. the story, like I said, just even like you said, uh, like Will said, you finally get to see Wanda really <clears throat> fuck up reality, like seeing how she's doing that and and everything. And then just all the implications that they gave us with Vision, with uh, Monica Rambo, with, you know, just like it's just it was yep. so much within it. And then they yeah. retconned, they retconned um, Darcy. Like I hated Darcy for the longest. And then yeah. when and and. and Partner her up with what Wu, right? His name is Wu, right? Oh uh, no, yeah. uh, no, is it Wu? I think Wu. so. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Right, yeah. His last name, yeah. yeah, yeah. Partner, partner them too. Well, I'm like, I would love to see them just I, a show of them just had like being in the in Marvel and dealing with everything and knowing what everything's going on. Like, like yeah. I thought that that was so dope. Loki, of course, like is my second one, and that you know Loki just because yep. one introducing us to King, uh, and then the whole multiverse and just really explaining that. And then like Will said, Owen Wilson, Owen Wilson did a phenomenal job because like you, when you think about the TVA it's like the TVA could have easily been some faceless organization. Right. But they mm -hmm. gave us somebody, to yep. actually, they, they gave us somebody to actually be emotionally connected with. Right. And kind of the sense. So what you were saying, Dion, that you liked it about Clint and, and, and Falcon and Winter Soldier, I mean, and, uh, Hawkeye, where you was like, he wanted to see him get home. Like, I really, I was like, fam, like his, his life, you, you, you knew his life was messed up due to the TVA. And I'm like, I want him to get back to his original life. Like, like, whatever his right. life I, was, want, I want Owen Wilson to get this jet ski, man. Yeah. Nah, it was a wrap. <laughs> yeah. It was now, a wrap. Where, the, where the jet ski at, baby? Right. Get the jet ski, bro. Like, I, want, <laughs> I wanted him to get back into that in regards to that. My third, actually, is going to be Miss Marvel. I thoroughly enjoyed everything about Miss Marvel. I went in. So, oh. one of the reasons why I, like, one of the reasons why I held Black Panther so high is because I said if there was culture in it, right? Like any time that a movie and uh, your hero has a culture to them, then it 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 gets like you get really into it. So the culture of Miss Marvel of 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 um the character and just kind of weaving that into this superhero story, and then we talked about it. She's us. She's a fan girl of these superheroes, and then like you go through her journey of I need to find myself. And throughout, and, and that's the underlying because throughout the whole thing, she's living up to this Miss Marvel standard. And she has so many people in her life telling her, no, you don't need to be the next Miss Marvel. You need to be the next you, right? You need mm -hmm. to be you, not Captain Marvel. So you've seen her find herself. And then the way that they, they laid those breadcrumbs into her finding her suit. You know, it's like, oh, you're going to get the suit here or you're going to get the scarf here or you're going to get your logo here. Like, I love that whole thing and her journey into it. I thought it was so d done. Trash. So no, it's done. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And sorry, then my, my bad. Keep going. And then how they introduced mutants. Just, oh, that, I was like, yo, they they did so much so fast just in that little bit. Like, whoa. <laughs> in it. Like, no, I, I lost my mind with that. And then even the Easter egg at the end, just like. Okay, I see. Like, yeah, there was so much that I loved about that, so I got that at three. Um, what else we got here? Like, what, what am I missing? Okay, we got. Oh, uh, you got Moon, uh, Moon Knight. I believe you also have Hawkeye, and then Captain America: Winter Soldier. All right, Moon Knight is my next I'm... one. Yep. yep, Moon Knight is my next one. I do like. I I I did like. Like I said, the the darker origin story of it and i felt like the only my only gripes against moon knight is i wanted to see way more moon knight hand-to-hand -hand action because when they showed yeah, us this, yeah. that nigga was going in 
Like he was yeah. beasty with that. And I'm like, bro, I need to see more of this. But I love the suit change. I love the three, like the multiple personalities of it and everything like that. I am going to give Falcon and Winter Soldier my next one. Like, Fuck I, out of here. I, I fucking love Falcon and Winter Soldier, bro. Like, I, wow. I there was some, there was there was a lot that I would take about. I don't I don't love Falcon and Winter Soldier. I liked it. There was a lot that I had some issues with, but like for the most part, like I did and I did enjoy again seeing the underbelly. I agree. We should have got way more into that underbelly, but I do. I, I did like the exposure that we got into it. I did like what what they did try to give us. But Hawkeye is my least. Again, the only thing there was two things. There was two things that I was heavily interested in. One again, I wanted to see when are we getting Kingpin, and two, I was like, oh shit, it's Clayton English. I want to see that nigga shine. That was, that, was that, 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 that was the only thing that I that was the highlight of that whole show. We definitely cared about Clayton English. For yeah. Sure. Yeah. First of all, I, I you know what's funny, and you know what's funny. This may, this may sound <laughs> like a hating comment, but it's not. I'm going to pre- preface it with that. But like when I saw Clayton English in the MCU, <laughs> I said, How yeah. the fuck did he get that? <laughs> yeah, and I, mean that, and I don't mean it from a place that he doesn't deserve it. Yeah, it's yeah, like. Yeah. To see a guy that's a comedian that's like one of us, yeah. right? He's yeah. one of us. I'm like one of us is in the yeah. MCU, yeah. dog. Yeah, and I, and I will huge. say, and I will, and say I was this so about, happy for him. Me too. And I'll say this about this for Clayton, and it's just like I don't know if he'll see this, but it's like the one thing I wish he would have done was I so wish he would have pushed that on social media further. Yeah, because Man. of that, I wanted to support him so much. Because the fact of it wasn't a line. It's like, bro. You You're are a, a takeaway character of this. Yes. Like, yes. I would love to see you come back in the MCU. Like that's like yeah. for the little time you had, yeah. I saw a story that could be written for you. And it was just like, I really yeah. wish you would have pushed that more on social it, media. Well, see, they being they can. This. And that's the thing that I was like, I, that's what I was hoping. Cause as soon as I saw him, I said, you know me, I'm like, I, let me do the research. So I'm figuring out who the character, that character is Clint, like one of his best friends, like in the comic, in the run, they, he right. has a long standing history with Hawkeye. So I'm like, oh shit, Clayton about to be in this motherfucker. Like I was so geeked about that. So like I was looking forward to that. You know what I'm saying? Especially, yes, at, yes. especially at the end, I was like, oh shit, he about to fight. And then he was just ushering people. I was like, all right, cool, whatever. I get it. I get it. But like I want to see, I want to see get fuck, get Clint, get Clayton the English to fucking Marvel body. Let that nigga bulk up. You know what I'm saying? Let him be like front line, you know, because like everybody got they they army. Yeah, the Hawkeye what it, army. You know what, what it saying? sounds like. What it sounds like to me though is we kind of all agree it's just in different, small, different orders. Like yeah. we yeah. all agree one and two is is most of us. Well, yeah, most of us agree one and two is Wanda Loki Vision. and Wandavision. Between yeah. there, you know, y- whether it's a per- you can you can you can flip flop either or. I'm not yeah. mad at Wandavision being one. Right. Nobody yeah. would be mad at Loki being one. Right. Um, mm-hmm. and vice versa. Then three, four, we all kind of agree. Like it's except except uh. Dion, <laughs> uh, but we all kind of agree three four is Miss Marvel and Moon Knight. Yep, you know what I'm saying? It could go either or, <laughs> and then same thing with Captain America and and, and Hawkeye. It's like I yeah, could go either or with that too. I yeah. think Captain America, you know, or Falcon Winter Soldier is the worst one, but I can understand why you know five and six ain't the ain't it's, it's not a big yeah. deal. They both can sit in that mail room and say, <laughs> Fuck it, you yeah. don't need a season two, Fact. yeah, but uh, but yeah, so yeah. that that's our take on theirs. You don't know what you do to me. You don't know what you do to me. 